hey guys welcome back to my channel as you can see today's video is going to be about a winter wash routine so right now my hair has this apple cider vinegar clarifying rinse from the beauty supply store um i'm not sure how much it is or where my mom got it from but i will put all its information in the description box below so right now my hair is four parts in the front and then let me see don't mind my beauty beads lord it's two in the back um i separated my hair and i like rinsed 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 my hair with this in it not rinsed drenched drench my hair with this in it i let it sit for a while i wash the dishes for about 20 minutes it's been in my hair um it makes my hair really soft it's easy to finger detangle oh god lord that one wasn't but the rest have been easy to finger detangle and yeah so let's get into the bed okay guys so right now i'm just taking the ponytail out of my hair so i can get ready to rinse the apple cider vinegar out of my hair struggling a little bit but you know i got it look at my curls popping sis so i'm rinsing my hair out <clears throat> gotta get all the apple cider vinegar out because I don't want it to stay in there too long. I feel like it's going to damage my hair some kind of way. I don't know. So I'm draining of all the excess water. And now I'm about to shampoo my hair with my favorite shampoo by Cream of Nature. I put about, I don't know, I just squeeze the bottle until I feel like that's enough shampoo. And I massage it all into my hair massaging my scalp making sure that all the soap is getting in every crevice every part of my hair this shampoo gets really 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 soapy and makes a lot of suds and makes a lot of bubbles i really like it because it makes me feel like my hair is getting clean Um, yeah, so I'm about to rinse out the shampoo, rinse, 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 you gotta make sure you get all the shampoo out, and I'm gonna shampoo my hair twice, just so I can make sure I get all the dirt out, because, um, if you've watched any of my other videos, particularly my previous one, I shampoo often, but not that often. I haven't shampooed my hair in about three weeks. So, yeah. Um, Here's my second shampoo. Look at my curls, sis. Yes. Get into the curls. Yes. So, this shampoo, I'll just mainly focus on the um the tops of my hair and more of my scalp not really the ends because i did that in the first one mm. Mm -hmm. as i'm shampooing i'm also kind of finger detangling so i can prepare myself to comb my hair Oh, gosh, what just happened? I think I got some shampoo in my mouth. Oh, Lord. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. All right, so now I'm rinsing. Shampoo is getting all in my face, all in my eyes. It's just ridiculous. <clears throat> Got water all in. I got it, just not having a good day today. Having a really hard time trying to get my face together. Ooh. But y'all know that's the worst feeling when shampoo get in your eyes because it feels like your life is about to end. Gotta make sure all of it's gone. So 
Now I'm about to put some conditioner in my hair. My favorite cream of nature conditioner. Again, I don't really measure how much I put in. I just squeeze until I feel like it's enough. And gotta massage it into your scalp because your scalp is the most important part of your hair because that's where your hair grows out of and your pores are there and your pores need to be moisturized and have enough moisture in them i make sure i get all of my hair although it doesn't look like i'm putting a lot of conditioner in my hair i actually am my hair is very moisturized right now and very saturated with conditioner this conditioner just doesn't show as much and i kind of like that because you can also use it as a leave-in conditioner you don't have to just use it as a regular conditioner massaging massaging <clears throat> got some apple cider vinegar dripping into my face from the front of my hair see this is a struggle having natural hair is a struggle having hair in general is a struggle but now i'm about to put my hair Ooh, finger detangle first okay kirsten okay sus now I'm about to put my hair back into the ponytail so I can do the rest of my hair. If I can find the ponytail order. Yep, there it is. And boom. Boom. I don't know what I'm doing right here. I think I'm trying to get my face together. Yep. Stuff dripping all in my face again. Okay. So, I have finished washing my hair. I've conditioned all of my hair. I've taken the two parts of um, the front and just made four big ponytails. Right now, I am getting ready to detangle my hair. I am removing the ponytail holder so I can detangle. Um conditioning is my favorite part because it makes my hair feel so soft especially with this conditioner guys it's really a struggle like conditioner just all products just be in my eyes and i just can't sometimes like my eyes aren't going to fall off i'm putting a little bit more conditioner in my hair so i can um just be extra moisturized just to make myself feel good so now I'm about to use a wide tooth comb. Oop, oop, oh, oop, girl, what's going on there? So now I'm about to use a wide tooth comb to detangle my hair. I'm about to separate one tiny part just so I can take a gauge of how much detangling I'm actually going to have to do. So I take this one little part and I put the rest in a ponytail. And ponytail, ponytail, ponytail. And I'm going to comb this part of my hair just to see how bad my hair is detangled. It's not doing too bad, so I have a little knots here and there, but it could be worse. Um... So after I do that, oh gosh, there's conditioner in my face. Oh Lord. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. All right. Am I good? I'm good. Okay. Had to get my life together, guys. I'm sorry. This is just, this is just too much. Washing my hair is a very, very, very hard task. So, finished combing this out. Got all the nuts and knocks out. So, now I'm about to detangle this entire part. Finger detangling is key so you don't pull your hair out with the comb, going straight into the comb. Um, I honestly dislike finger detangling only because I hate feeling that my hair is tangled. It makes me depressed and sad, but it's good for your hair, so do it do it do it do it do it now 
getting my life together again oh look at me being all cute okay so now i'm about to comb all the knots from the top to the ends of my hair so i can just comb it out like that As you can see, I go back and forth from the top to the bottom of my hair combing it because it just works out for me that way. You don't people don't always have to do this way, but this is the way that I prefer to do it. I also like to separate my hair only because I feel like keeping your hair all out and trying to comb it is just doesn't work. It's just not effective to me. It feels like you're going to be doing way more work. So combing it, combing it. So once I've gotten about all the knots and the tangles out, I'm going to run my fingers through my hand. I'm run my fingers through my hand. Run my fingers through my hair, and I'm going to rinse out the conditioner. Gotta wipe my face off again, cause yeah. Oh gosh, what's going on? There's conditioner in my eye. Yep, yep, conditioner in my eye again. Sorry guys, sorry. That's all the hair that came out from just combing it. Oh god, conditioner again. Lord, Lord, help me, help me. Oh, I'm back. All right, one last comb through before I oh look at my curls popping popping yes yes so let's get into it yes 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 come through 4C hair yes okay so I'm just going to keep combing my hair. And now I'm about to rinse my hair out. If I would hurry up and get to that. I don't know what I'm taking to. Oh, trying to be cute. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what's wrong with me. I have issues. Okay, finally, I'm rinsing my hair out. Rinsing, being extra super duper careful not to rinse the conditioner out of the other parts of my hair. Because I have yet to comb that and then renting that out would just defeat the purpose of even having it in okay so i rinsed it out i rinsed all the conditioner out of my hair i'm draining the water and yes my curls are coming through so i'm going to go through and comb my hair one more time just to make sure that i can comb it without having conditioner in it because that's what detangling is for making sure you can comb your hair without having any product in it Looks like I'm struggling a little bit, but you know, I'm doing great, doing great. My curls coming through, yes. My curls are coming through. I love this color on me. This is just pretty. So now I'm about to braid my hair so it can stay detangled because putting it back in a ponytail, for my type of hair, putting it back in a ponytail will just make it more tangled or make it tangled again. So I'm going to braid it into a nice plait fun fact about me i cannot cornrow yep can't cornrow i don't know why i don't know how just can't do it sorry if i'm hurting anybody's feelings but i just can't do it Whew. so here's my nice little braid about to put a scrunchie on the end of it so it doesn't come out Yep, there's my braid, nice and thick. Kind of long too. Oh, I'm cute. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm trying. Okay, guys, as you can see, I'm done combing and conditioning my hair. A drop. Ace. <laughs> so now I'm about to use my leave-in conditioner from Cantu, my favorite product in the whole entire world, to moisturize my hair. So I'm removing my braids 
and I'm going to comb it just to make sure I still have my detangled hair comb it nice 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 doing great sis yes yes okay so I'm combing it and I use a lot of this I just take a I just plop it into my hand and I just work it all through my hair because I really like when my hair is moisturized because it's very soft and it makes me happy so I run it through my hands run it through my hair I wow somebody's honking the horn oh so I divided the top of my hair back into two pieces on each side so it could be easier to comb and yeah so this is me combing out the second braid about to throw some leave-in conditioner up in that show <laughs> just running my hands through my hair i have really have no method of evenly like distributing the product i just do it until i feel like all my hair is moisturized i especially run my hands onto my scalp as you can see this is all the product i run my hands onto my scalp and rub them there because i want my scalp to be very moisturized we don't want any dandruff any dry scalp So now I'm putting my hair back into a ponytail so I can move on to the next section of my hair. Oh, that's a cute little bun that I did. I'm so proud of myself. Okay, so I'm moving on to the next section of my hair and I'm just going to repeat the process all over my entire head combing it combing it combing it y'all i don't know why i try to sing because i just can't do it so i'm gonna stop i'm sorry so getting some leave-in conditioner and i'm about to just pop that joint onto my head I like the way my curls look when they're combed out because they just seem so much more defined to me. Here I am massaging my scalp again. That's my favorite part. Not only is it good for you, it just feels good. And like if anybody's ever just played in your hair, it just feels good when you do it to yourself. Like, I don't know, maybe I'm just weird. All right, moving on to my second braid. Taking it out. combing it so I can um, put some more leave-in conditioner in it that's my dog guys I don't know if you can hear it but I'm sorry she's being an idiot right now because she wants to leave because my mom just came in here and tried to talk to me but I don't understand why she tried to talk to me guys And now she's looking at me with the sad puppy eyes. But I'm I'm not going to get up and open the door for her while I'm doing something. Like, why does she, why is she so spoiled? I don't understand. Don't look at me, Pixie. Just leave me alone. No, don't start crying. So, here I am massaging the leave -in conditioner into my hair. It feels so good. See, closing my eyes. See, it feels so good. It feels so good. Now I'm about to move on to the back of my hair. Look at my edges. Slick down without any edge control. Yes, get into you. Yes. My mini mouse bun. Oh, yup. Oh, yup. Okay. Oh, that probably hurt me. Curls, get into the curls, curls. 
<laughs> so cute. So, again, I'm just combing to make sure I got all the tangles. In total, this process, the washing, the combing, the moisturizing, I would say this process takes me about 45 minutes to an hour only because when I do my hair, I do it to make sure it's right. Like, I want my hair to be moisturized. I don't know what I'm doing. I want my hair to be moisturized and I want it to feel good and look good. So the washing part takes about, I would say, 20 minutes and then combing it out. Each section takes about three minutes. So I would say 10 minutes to comb. So that's 30 minutes. And then I'm, while I'm conditioning my hair, I wash my body and stuff. So that's that. And then... Wow. Oh, I just lost my train of thought. Oh, so then after I condition, comb, and I do this process, this probably takes about 10 minutes. So that's about 40 minutes. And then styling. Styling is a whole nother process, sis. Like, it takes so long. It just, it all depends on what kind of style I want to do. I think I'm going to bantu knot my hair tonight. And that's going to take four hours. It's going to take like two hours to do that because just because it is. Because I'm a, I'm a perfectionist and it's going to take forever. So, yeah. So, I'm on to my last section and I'm trying to do that. And, yeah. Getting all the parts of my hair did. Because you know you got to be moisturized. In the back, I mainly focus on my roots and my ends. Simply because that part of my hair can tend to be the weakest part of my hair. And my ends break off back there slightly more than they do in the front of my hair. So... Yeah, all of my scrunchies are knotted because I'm an idiot and I don't know what I did, but they're all knotted, so I had to take it, take one out. But so that's that. Putting my hair in a ponytail so I can have it separated while it's moisturized. And yeah, these are my four little buns: two on the front, two on the back. So after doing all of my routines and do all that stuff i just keep my hair like this and moisturize until i figure out what i'm gonna do with my hair i might put it in bantu knots i'm not sure yet i'm very indecisive when it comes to styling my hair but that was my wash video i hope you guys enjoy it share subscribe like comment and yeah all the descriptions of each product that I use, price, where I could get it from, name, all that would be in the description box below. Um, share this video to your friends and come back next weekend for another video. Mm -hmm.